My name is Vanessa Gigliotti. Having battled stage four colon cancer at 28 has left me with a lot of issues. Issues like herniated discs, neuropathy, painful scar tissue, and what my orthopedic surgeon likes to call a spine that looks like it got massive amounts of radiation when in fact, I got massive amounts of chemo. I am very grateful that chemo has helped me to live longer. However, whether you are in treatment or you're done with treatment, we have to do everything possible to live our best lives one day out of the time. And the way I found this is through yoga. Practicing yoga has many benefits, especially when you suffer from neuropathy, because it helps to relax your body and improve the flow of blood to your extremities. For me, it helps to center my attention to my body by controlling my movements and through poses, right? Not only test your endurance, but it has you stretching in ways that you didn't even know were possible. Yoga helps me clear my mind. And it also helps me to be conscious of my breathing, which helps so tremendously with the metastatic cancer that I had in my lungs that left, I think, the worst of all the scar tissue and also the most painful. Some of my favorite poses include the Padsmana. That's a pose which you sit down, you put your feet in front of you and stretch it out. And you also stretch out your arms in front of you. And you could kind of wiggle your toes and wiggle your hands and fingers and breathe. And you stretch and stretch as much as you can. This is the most amazing way to get the blood flowing to your extremities. And that's especially helpful when you're having a very painful neuropathy day. My other favorite poses include the downward dog and the warrior pose. That so helps with painful back when it's tight and there's a lot of inflammation. Another other favorite poses are the cobra and the upward dog. That helps with neck, like the painful neck herniated discs. And when you have nerve damage that goes down up and down your arms, I definitely recommend those two poses. But my absolute favorite is the spinal twist. So this one isn't great to start off with. This is when you need, a, you have a little more endurance and you've learned to move your body a little better. The spinal twist does not um, activate or make my hernias pop out, right? And it also does not affect any issues that I have in my body. Instead, it makes me feel like I got a full body massage. I personally recommend yoga for every single cancer patient out there. For me personally, it's helped relieve anxiety. It's helped me to get flexibility back in my body. It's helped me to walk normal again. And it's helped with scar the tightness of scar tissue. Who knows? Practicing yoga, we may make a yogi out of you yet.